Welcome everyone to another Empires and Puzzles Books test drive video. I don't normally test drive two heroes together, but when their synergy makes this much sense, I need to do it. So this is a pretty exciting new synergy. Uh, this is from Season 5, Dynasty of the Dunes. We have Conchu, 5-star hero, combined with 4-star Aotep. Uh, I'm going to get into the description of the two of them and why I think the synergy is so fascinating in just a moment. But when I recorded this video, I forgot to also point out that they have the family bonus. Uh, they're both part of the Moon family. So for two heroes, they get a 20% chance to cast negative 24% defense for two turns and 98 water damage over two turns on the enemy on an enemy who deals special skill damage to this character. And also, if the enemy special kill defeats the character, the chance is 50 to 75%. So somewhere in here, I think I referenced that water damage on a hero, uh, and I incorrectly attributed it to uh, the my hero special giving it. It was actually from the other hero uh, attacking my, my, my two uh, heroes here with their special, which gave them that water damage. Anyway, I'm going to get into the rest of the description as to why I think the synergy and why this team is interesting. As always, I'm curious to hear your thoughts. Go ahead and give me your uh, feedback below. Thank you. Today, we're going to be looking at some interesting team synergy with the uh, Season 5 Dynasty of the Dunes heroes. I have two of them maxed here. Khonshu and Aotep, and there's some interesting things going on between the two of those. So this team is designed to be incredibly fast and to be generating mana in all sorts of ways. So Onyx doesn't need any introduction, Ninja Hero, five tiles ready to at least hit one. Sergei, also five tiles ready to do elemental defense down, Magic Hero, and Exnofod needs no introduction. But just keep in the back of your mind that when he goes off, he increases the mana of all allies by 20%, and he's also increasing how much mana they get from the tiles on the board. But what I'm really interested in this video is talking about the relationship between Khonshu and Aotep. So if we look at their basic specials, Aotep deals 340% damage to the target, Minor to the nearby. If the target is defeated in the next three turns, all of their allies get 20% mana. So that's 20% mana on top of the 20% mana they might have gotten from Hexnafold. So all we need is Aotep to weaken the target enough that Conchu, with this 1010 attack power, will then kill deals 425% to the target. That is a massive hit. If the attack defeats the target, the caster gains 50% mana. Now this is already a very fast hero. So, if my math is correct, if Kanchu delivers the killing blow to a target that Aotep weakened, he will get 50% mana as the killer but he'll also get 20% mana from Aotep's special. So assuming those two stack, he will get 70% mana, and he's very fast. So it's like, what, just another couple, a tile or two? And you throw in um, Exnafold's 20%. I mean, it's. I, I'm, I'm curious to see how, I have not used this team yet. I'm gonna use it first time here, live here. Uh, I'll be curious to see how fast we can get this guy going. Now, when he uses his special skill, there's a 40% chance that he'll deal 70% damage to all enemies. 70% on top of that 1,000 plus attack is nothing to, you know, that's pretty significant. All enemies get negative 24% mana generation for three turns. So it also could slow down the enemy. And he's a barbarian, so, you know, 30% chance to apply bleeding from normal attacks, blah, blah, blah. Aotep over here on his passive has a 60% chance to give 70% damage to all enemies and dispels the latest buff from all enemies that's dispellable. So it kind of works as a debuffer too. So I'm going to do a friendly battle here. Got one of my uh, alliance mates who has a holy hero out front. 
So I'm going mono. I want to have a target. All right. Well, we got six tiles. And that's all we really need. And actually, I can get them in one... Well, check this out. One hit, they'll get all six. Boom. All right. So, elemental defense down. I'm curious. I wonder if he could kill with that defense down. Can he take out Lady of the Lake? She has how much left? 850 left. Can we do 850 damage? I think we might be able to. Boom! 1200. <laughs> oh, that was fun. Alright, so for giggles, let's just pop her anyway. Now... Exnafold and Heotep are both average, so they, they should get up to speed together. Bring our darks down. And here we go. This is where this crazy synergy should happen. So let's check this out. Who do we want to pop? Uh... Let's go with Moral. So he's going to get weakened from this hit. And now he should get smacked. Now, uh, let's see what this says here. If the character is defeated, all enemies get 20% mana. And his special would get 70%. So he, I'm going to try to kill him with this hero. And he, he should come almost right back up to speed. Oh, it did not kill him. Well, that sucks. That's actually an interesting counter to Freya, too, because Freya kills that mana. Now, I wasn't paying attention to the specials or the other passives. It looks like uh, Moral had water damage there. Now, if you notice, everybody got that mana from Aotep when Moral died. He was the target. All right. Uh, not super excited about my board at this point. Well, we can at least pop one more dark tile. We should be okay. I just need to find a dark tile. Alright, I am sick of these minions taking swipes at me, so let's go get rid of some of them. Slide up the center. Come on, dark tile. There we go. And we're back in business. So, elemental defense down. She withstood that. I'm going to pop over here. And 12.50. I don't know that without the elemental defense down, he might be not be doing that much. Well, let's pop here. Get the mana back. So he, look, his mana jumped right back up. Lost the mana on Exnafold because of her dying. All right, then. That is that. All right, so I have another enemy or teammate here. This is a goofy defense that they have set up that's actually been doing really well for them. So we're gonna go ahead and see how we can do against this. Got two targets for my holy here. Whew. That is an ugly board for darks. I'm gonna sneak a dark up between these. Nope.
three pop him. That was fortunate. We're getting to six slowly, but we're gonna have some problems there with uh, the tree going off. Oh, all kinds of action happening. Alright, we saw that 1200 damage before. This should not be a problem. That should bring him right back up to speed. And it did not. Should have loosened him up with a... Uh, To loosen him up with Onyx first. This might look like a loss. And we're in trouble. Alright. Well, that was a miserable starting board. Let's go ahead back and see if we can do something a little better. Well, that'll be cheating. Take them both out on the first shot. really curious why that was not enough to pop him. We had 1200 damage on... I guess the defense is that high. Alright, well let's loosen him up. Get him back up to speed. I'm really not getting the tiles to show what I wanted to show between Aotep and... Uh, Maybe we'll get it here. Alright. Well, we're getting the attack power here. Let's try it over on Scotty. Right. He resisted. See, that's not going to do it either. Well, with the attack up, maybe. Nope. that one more time. Well, let's see if we have another team that has a holy out front. There we go. Thank you, Salmon. I really thought this would be a little more instructive as far as the mana speed between these two heroes. But we've not been getting tiles to fall exactly to see him. Alright. Elemental defense down. Come over here. And that should be able to kill him. So now we should be able to see it. So... He has that, if this character is defeated, all enemies get 20% mana. If, if Kanush, Kanshu, excuse me, it's been printed. if Kanshu kills him, then he should get 70% mana. There we go. See, now look at that. His mana is all the way up. We'll do X. And that should put him back to speed. Check that out. Boom. Back again. Got that mana back. It is so fast. So silly, silly fast. So it took this, this last one here to show it, but you can see how fast we can get him back up to speed. And that's going to probably be game. I guess he doesn't get credit for the kill shot if they revive. Oh no, he did. See, his mana came back up even on the revive. That is fantastic. I'm liking the synergy of those two heroes. Let's, uh... I do have one more. Let's do that again. We'll give you guys one more here. Let's see if we can make that happen. 
All right, uh, pop her again. I'm just really intrigued at the speed of this team. Uh, a red diamond. All right, we're going to eat a hit here. Okay, loosen her up a bit. Not sure we get the kill shot. And that mana is right back. Alright, we're not going to be using Aotep this time. Kill Pengi, and we're right back up. Look at that. Look at that, look at that, look at that. Got that mana for maximum. Alright. Uh, defense down. Loosen him up. Kill shot. And the mana is right back. So what do you think? Those two heroes working pretty good together? <laughs>